Mr. DeSanto, good to see you. Gotta give me some cush after ride tripping on these fools. That's about right. Hey, let's grill up some burgers next Cousin week. Floyd Better said strip it. clubs objectify women, but you ain't objects. You're people. What's good? Hey, before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Merriweather, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score, and then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, Happy. <laughs> so how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you must know Leon, the old manager. Leon? I didn't know. Yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago, in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. Uh, yeah, sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there were other guys, though, too. So, uh, anyway, we uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. But always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one! What is the big one? <laughs> the Union Depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if we live through the attempt. But, but it'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. We're on a strict schedule. There's a couple of armored cars on a dry run to the depository. Intel suggests they'll be going down Innocence Boulevard in East LS at approximately 15.30. Trevor and I need to map their route for a possible hijack point. So, we're going to his airfield in Blaine County and we'll be back in his chopper to intercept. Michael, Franklin, all you've got to do is take the temperature at the bank, see if there's anything that stands out. You'll get 20% of 200 million. A maximum of 200 million, if I can get the funds diverted and you pull it off. Still, come on, 20% of that's a lot of coin for sitting on your fat ass. Is it too much to ask for a little respect? Just a little? Because I respect you, Trevor. Strangely, I do. I can see how you're useful. T, L, we're coming up to the front of the bank. Well, I can think of a few uses for you, you chubby little ball of fun. I want your help. All 20% of 200 million of it. Actually, man, I've got another job I want your help with after this. Yeah, right. Whatever. No. Seriously. A big job. Payment up front. What is it? Yeah. I don't know why I didn't think of it before. I want to bring you in on the ground floor this time. That's not a joke about disabled access. I didn't think it was, but now I do. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. What is it? Ain't it obvious? Bustin' Brad out of the clink. Okay, I'm gonna stop you there, T. Some things are just better left alone. Brad's not a thing. He's part of the crew. Well, a crew's more than a sum of its parts, and he was a... And he was a pretty shit part. He is a pretty shit part, and that's only because he's in jail. 
No, he was, is shit because he's lazy, forgetful, mean, and stupid. With respect. He's changed, all right? He writes now, emails, he's educated himself inside, and he'll be a valuable part. All right, we're here. Only one security guard. Looks like a normal consumer bank up here. We're going down to the back entrance, see where the gold comes out. Why don't you talk to Michael about it? I will, but I gotta talk to you too. You're planning this. Talk to Michael, then come back to me. Oh, fine. Shit. I was gonna pay you, man. When there ain't an obvious profit in something, you're a hard guy to motivate. We're down on Alta Street, coming up on the back of the bank. Just went 1330. We got two hours before we need to be in Murrieta Heights. Don't worry, it's a straight road. They'll come out the other side. Ah! 
Expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that. Looking for a big asshole. ideas. It's gonna take a while to get them together or work them up, but I think there's a way. It's not impossible. All right. We'll start thinking about the breakout, too. Bradley Snyder. He's getting bored. Talk to Michael, okay? Goodbye. <laughs> 